Hello and welcome to Front Runner Motorsport. We previously looked at the five Formula 3 2021 drivers with the most potential to get to Formula 1. Now let's take a look at five drivers who I had high hopes for who didn't meet those standards. Five drivers who will have to do better next time. So remember to subscribe, we are so close to 500 now. Just one more little push and we will hit that target. So with that, let's begin. Matteo Nanini. It was always weird that Matteo Nanini was down to race in both Formula 2 and Formula 3. Well, he disappointed in both, and has only had a few races in Formula 2. He may have taken his first win in Hungary, but there isn't a whole lot more to shout about, and he hasn't improved greatly from 2020. We have seen good racing from this guy, but he needs to do it at every round, not just every now and again. He gets caught up in too many incidents too. Hopefully another year in Formula 3 will iron out some of those creases. Roman Stanek. I keep hearing that this Czech driver is one to watch. Well, I have been watching and I'm yet to be amazed. I watched him in both the Asian F3 and the Formula 3 series and he hasn't been spectacular in either. He got a couple of podiums in 2021 but he still only finished 16th with high tech as opposed to 21st with Chirous in 2020. He has won a race in the Euro Formula Open Championship in 2021, so maybe he can do it, and maybe we will see it in 2022. Ollie Caldwell and Arthur Leclerc. I mean, just because they're driving for Prema, right? I did say in my preview at the start of the year that Prema had a weaker lineup than usual. In 2019, the third best Prema car finished third. In 2020, the third best Prema car finished fourth. In 2021, the third best Prima car of Arthur Leclerc finished 10th. It's a big jump and Ollie Caldwell didn't do much better in 8th. It's Caldwell's second season, finishing 2020 in 16th with Trident. He took his first win and it was better. Arthur Leclerc was on his first season and also took a win, but you just expect better from Prima's drivers in Formula 3. It'll be interesting to see if either of these two are kept on for 2022. Ido Cohen. There are not many great Israeli drivers in motorsport. When the best known is Roy Nassani, you know things are going badly. Ido Cohen seemed like a step up for me. I remember watching him in the motorsport games in 2019 and thinking he was a name for the future. He was a bit of a letdown in the Toyota Racing Series in 2020, but I was excited to see him with Carlin in Formula 3 for 2021. He scored no points and honestly, really only found himself at the right end of the field once all year. And even then, he made contact with Dennis Hager, broke his wing and dropped back. I hope he gets another chance. Roy Nassani shouldn't be the best driver in your country's history. Roy Nassani shouldn't be the best anything. Logan Sargent. So this was attempt number three in Formula 3 for American Logan Sargent. It was also a massive step backwards. In 2019, he was at the back of the field with Carlin and only scored a handful of points, finishing 19th. He got a move up to Prima in 2020, challenged for the title but in the end only managed to finish third in the championship. So in 2021 with the Chirouz team, he hasn't really performed. He took a win and finished seventh which doesn't sound too bad but after three seasons his time might be up. Not many drivers get four seasons and he will definitely be the most experienced driver in the field if he is there at all. I think he'll be lost in the hell that is random GT series. Something like the Blanc Payne series, lost in the midfield somewhere, completely forgotten and lost to time. So there are five drivers who could have done better in 2021. Maybe they'll improve in 2022. Maybe they'll be looking for a job down the post office. Do you agree or is there someone else you'd put on this list? Let me know down in the comments below. Also, remember to subscribe. Really close to 500 subscribers now. I'm going to start on a week of videos to celebrate hitting 500 when it happens. So the quicker we get there, the more motivated I'll be to make them. Like the video, tell your friends, thank you for watching, and have a good one.